Hello guys and welcome. It's Engineering Rebel and in this video I'm going to give you guys four reasons why modern engines make a lot of power. So let's begin. Now before I list all four reasons, this particular engine is an EA888 engine. So this is a VW engine. It's actually very commonplace in Audi and VW products. It's in the Golf GTI, it's in a lot of base model Audi products. It's a 2 liter turbo inline 4 that makes around 252 horsepower and 273 pound feet of torque. It has a cast iron block, also cast iron heads, and it's been around for some time. The first reason why modern engines make a lot of power is because of gasoline direct injection. Now, older engines would use something called port injection where the fuel would get sprayed into the intake manifold and from there on would go to the combustion chamber. But this way you got two fuel pumps. You got a traditional one out and back where it pumps the fuel from the fuel tank up front to the engine. But in this case, a secondary fuel pump, kind of like a diesel, boosts the fuel pressure up to 3000 PSI and that's later sent to the cylinders. You can see that there is two here, that's cylinder one, two here, cylinder two, another two here for cylinder three, and another one here for cylinder number four. Now the second reason why modern engines make a lot of power is because of turbocharging. Now if we go by the exhaust manifold, you can see the turbo way down there, that, and the rest of it's over there. Now what that does is it uses the exhaust gases to spin a propeller and that later sucks in air and the air is sent through from here, from down there, actually the plastic fans are covering it up, but it, that air is sent through an intercooler and that intercooler makes the air more dense and as it comes out the intercooler, you can see that this big hose right here that I'm pointing at, that has the Audi logo, comes up through there and goes straight to the intake manifold. So it goes from the turbo through the intercooler and into the intake manifold. Now, for those of you wondering how turbos work, I've made a YouTube video dedicated for that. I highly recommend that you go check it out. The third reason why modern engines make a lot of power is due to variable valve timing. Now, variable valve timing uses the engine's oil pressure, and as the RPMs increase, it will change the timing of the cams for better fuel efficiency and more power. Some older engines from the past only had variable valve timing on the intake camshaft and not the exhaust. But modern engines these days have it on both the intake camshaft and the exhaust. Now this part of the engine is the intake manifold. So the variable valve timing actuator for the intake would be on this side and the one for the exhaust would be on the other side because that's where your exhaust manifold is located. Now the final reason on why modern engines make a lot of power, and this doesn't apply to all cars, but the ones that have it this reason definitely applies is because of electronic power steering now if you come to the front of the engine take a look at the serpentine belt you could see here is the alternator there is the ac compressor water pump somewhere down there but if you look you won't see a power steering pump that's because this engine doesn't have one yes you heard that right no power steering pump so when i go ahead to start the car and when i go ahead to move the steering wheel the steering wheel moves, but it's all electronic. There is no power steering pump or power steering fluid. It's all electronic. Now, because of this, the engine has less load and further makes more power. And as a result, the engine has better gas mileage and more power. So think of it this way. Haven't you ever driven your car with the AC on and you feel like the car has less power? That's because the engine has to run all its accessories and the AC compressor. The same theory applies to a power steering pump. Now the engine has to run all this and a power steering pump, therefore creating more load on the engine. So those are my four reasons why modern engines make a lot of power. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. More awesome videos are to come, so please hit that subscribe button. I will see you guys in the next one.